Hello friend, this is Calvin's. Today I just want to actually show you how you can uh, bulk print the report card uh, using Prosmat exam system. So there is two way there are two ways of uh, bulk printing the report cards from Prosmat system. You can either bulk print direct to the printer, uh, whichever printer you are connected to, or you can bulk print to PDF. So when you bulk print to, uh, to to the connected printer, you'll be able to collect all the report cards for that particular class from your printer. But when you are bulk printing to PDF, you will be able to collect or, or rather save all the report cards at once in uh, a folder on your desktop. All right. So. I also want to tell you how you can back up your file so that you'll, you'll be able to refer to it uh, next time. So first of all, you, we need to put in our username. Okay. Uh, then we put uh, the password, admin. Then we log in. So most of you are well conversant with this system. So it can do a lot of things. This system does a lot of things. Uh, look at all these. These are all analysis uh, analysis that the system will be able to handle. You able to see it handles merit list, the overall merit list, overall grade analysis, merit list uh, agenda, stream merit list, subject stream grade analysis, grade analysis agenda subject grade analysis overall stream grade analysis grade analysis uh, in terms of houses the dormitories subject champions top students overall and of course graphical representation and then the report cards so all those uh, analysis uh, or kinds of analysis this is the system is able to handle and then here we have all the, you are able to select subjects. Then here you are able to add data. Then the score sheets are here. Then here you will be able to upload images and logos and uh, sign signatures for head teachers and class teachers and even a rubber stamp. Then here we have promotion of the students and then uh, phone numbers are added here. And then here we have some settings. You can do various settings. Then of course there is also SMS SMS setup. Uh, as you are aware, this system is able to send even SMSs on uh, performance and on general information. So today, uh, because already the video is already on the WhatsApp on how to use this system, today I just want to uh, give a little bit of a demonstration on the few updates that have been put into it. Then uh, that will be. Uh, just okay. So we have uh, you can back up This is uh, you can back up the file so you are able to uh, view those back up files later on Then before we go to back up. I want to show you how you are able to bulk print uh, To PDF. So let us uh, generate report card. So as we go to the report card uh, we will be able to see this just a report card which is belonging to Condoleezza Risi. Uh, these are all students in this class, this is from one class. So when you click any of the students, the report card will be generated here. Let me click uh, Milka. So you'll be able to see report card being generated as you uh, watch. So when you want to print just one, you will just select the report card, then you go to print current. But most of us will want to print all the report cards at once, either through PDF or through a current printer. So uh, for bulk printing to a current, to current or connected printer, you will be able to uh, click this bulk print, then all the report cards will be printing one by one, and you will be collected, collecting all the report cards from your printer. So that one already had demonstrated. So the new one that uh, I've included as an update is bulk printing to PDF. So when you click bulk print to PDF, 
you'll be able to uh, save all the report cards in a folder so that you can even uh, save them for future reference or something so uh, you can also take the saved uh, PDF files and then uh, put them in a flash disk then print them somewhere else if you like then you can also combine all the podcasts that you have on in that particular folder you can combine them uh, into one document so that when you are printing or when you are putting uh, in a, a flash uh, and uh, moving to another printer to print you will be able to uh, collect them one by one without necessarily printing each file separately so let me show you how you will be able to bulk print so you click bulk print so when you click bulk print like that you are able to see that the printing has just begun you see now this is wonderful you'll be able to see that it's printing one by one so you can see this is for Fiani Atieno. Then the next one is for Daisy Crazy. And then the next one is for uh, this girl uh, called, let me see. Uh, we have Condelisa Risi. So once printing is complete, we will be able to have all the report cards in a folder. So let us just be patient until all the report cards are printed so it's printing them right away as you able to see that is Yvette Marion so those are students at a certain school so don't worry so that's June Accord so you're able to see it's printing uh, one by one so the only work you'll be doing is just to open the folder and view the report cards saved there then maybe you will be able to put them in a, a flash you want to print them in a print uh, using a printer you will be able to print them one by one but now I would urge you to combine them into one document so that when you are printing using a printer then the printer will print that one as a one document or as a single document so they will be coming out one by one without you uh, having to do what? Having to print each file separately. Because when you don't combine those report cards in that folder, then it means when you go with them, maybe in a flash, to another printer, you will have to print each one by one, clicking print button one after the other and that one will be a very difficult work that you'll not be able to to uh, manage so what you do you simply combine all those report cards into into one or into a single document so that you'll be able to print at once so it will be just like another bulk printing okay using connected printer uh, but once it's complete, it will give us a notification like now you can see this notification is already here. All from one report cards have been printed and saved in the report cards from one folder on your desktop. Then you say, okay. So uh, that is the process. We have pre printed them. So we, when you go back home, let me go back home so that I exit the report card section. So when if you minimize this particular window, you'll be able to see the podcast from one. So when we open it, you're able to see there are all report cards that we printed. They're all here. You can see them. So even if you open report card one, report card one is for the first student. So you're able to see, let me minimize. So that let not minimum, let me zoom out so you'll be able to see the report card. So you can see even the rubber stamp is very, very nicely uh, put there. So that is the report card for this uh, student in position one. You're able to see position one here. So <clears throat> you can also view a position two report card. Okay. 
so you can see this day one for position two. You can see. So that is how you you can view all of them. So when you put these files, reported files, into a flash disk, you'll be able to print them one by one, which may be also another uh, difficult to work. So what you do, you simply combine them into one, uh, into one document, so that when you are printing, you only click once, then it is a one document, it will print one document, producing the report card one by one. So each report card will come, will, will uh, occupy a page. So like here, we will have uh, 32 pages. We'll have 32 pages of uh, these report cards. So let me show you. So you'll have, <coughs> you'll have to ensure that you have uh, this one in your, this uh, PDF merger and the splitter in your computer. Uh, yes, if you, if you want it, it's already downloadable. Just go to your Play Store <coughs> in your computer. Then you will be able to, uh, you'll be able to download it very well. Okay, you'll be able to download it very well. Then once you have it in your computer, you will be merging your report cards. So you simply click Merge PDF, combine uh, PDFs into one PDF document. So when you click that, <coughs> you will be able to see this window here. Okay, so you just click Add PDFs. So here you will you will uh, maneuver to wherever you put in your folder having the report card. So here it is, report card from once. So just double click it, then say, click uh, uh, press Control A to select all the report cards because you want to combine all of them into one document. Then once you have done that, just put open. So all the report cards are here. You able to see all of them are here. So after that, you click Match PDF, okay? Match. So when you click Match PDF, all the report cards will be merged into one or into a single document. So let me click Match. So we want to, uh, let us just put them into which folder, want to put them into folder where the folder for report cards are so that we don't have to keep it very far. So the mind folder, let us put the mind folder here, just where our report cards are, yeah, okay. So mind folder, just save there. So the process has begun, and it normally goes very fast, very fast, very fast. Uh, it's almost complete. So once it's complete, we will have our mind folder in the report card from one folder so it's already done so we just uh, close it so after closing you can even close uh, this one here so when you look at your folder this folder where you are you are keeping your form one uh, report cards when you look at this folder you'll also be able to see the match the remind report remind pdf it is here this one here so you're able to see the mind one there so when you open the mind one, it is a single document. It is a single document which carries all the all the report cards. So we we'll just uh, it is opening it. Uh, PDF, my PDF, I think is updating something. Okay, so you'll be able to see that now. This is now the report card number one. Let me zoom out so you can see this is the position one. So, so when you when you scroll down, you see each report card on this page. You can see each report card is now for position two. Then this is now position three. So is it not a wonderful thing? You can see this position four. So all the report cards are now in a single document. All the report cards are now in a single document, and then it means now when you are printing, it will be printed as a single document with each report card just coming out from the printer uh, in a very nice way. So it's like now you are you will be bulk printing, okay? Because they are treated as 
it is treated as one document okay so you can see all of them all of them are now in a single document as you would see so is that not very nice very very nice so if you want to use that particular new tool or the new updates that are included in this particular software feel free to contact me my email is kelcalvins78 at gmail.com uh, you can also contact me uh, using the help button here you have the help button here you'll be able to see my con contacts there otherwise i want to appreciate you but before i close you are able to back up your file when you click back up when you click back up here uh, you will be able to back up your file into an e drive you'll be able to back up it into an e drive so when you go there you'll find your file backed up very nicely and you'll be able to use it for future reference okay so those are the few updates that we have uh, you can see the backup complete and file has been saved into the e drive uh, the full life exam backup okay so that is very nice you also have the mark list when you click this one <coughs> you'll be able to <coughs> you'll be able to see mark list so when you click that one uh, you'll be able to see mark list so this is a mark list a very modern mark list with the kcp points and then ranks so you'll have to put the target here your target then this is the score for whichever exam you want to uh, enter into the system so this one you can print and give the teachers to enter marks then the marks will be fed into the system uh, in that particular minor so you can go to form 2 class list then you can view all the uh, other class list okay so colleagues that is very nice of this particular system want to leave it at that point until next time thank you very much and may god bless you thank you